if we stubbornly pursue excellence in our perceptions and skills, we can offer paintings that will be true in ever new ways. We will do well to take a lesson from Mozart and Bach and others and create things so compellingly beautiful that we can't imagine a world without them. first view of Abbotsford. You can imagine not having ever seen Abbotsford and then suddenly coming upon this beautiful, beautiful, otherworldly view of a fairy castle. This is the richness of Sir Walter's mind that he would conceive of such a place. just beginning the first of two sketches from life. In total, I think I worked out there for five full days uh, of painting. That's me in my studio. The sketch that I did outdoors is over my left shoulder, using that as a reference for the color. The thing is, in painting it, I didn't want it to look like an architectural rendering, like an architect would show you. I wanted it to look like a serious painting that had interesting romantic edges and color changes and so on. And so I had to continually keep that vision of what I wanted this painting to look like as I went along. I wanted it, the painting to look like I just did it like that. And it just happened without all of this hard work. I was enjoying the, the fascination of problem solving rather than looking at problems as, a, uh, as, as something to have to endure. That's my, my vision of Abbotsford. Thank you.